Hello viewers, another TradingView top tip for you. Now you're into stock trading and maybe you've been wondering how you can see pre-market and sort of after hours trade activity. Very crucial for say gap and go start of the day trading strategies, which I will take a quick look at here. But maybe you're a user of TradingView charts and say, well, I can't see that information on my charts do i have to pay for it is it you know an expensive add-on well no it's not it's there on this video i'm going to show you how you can quickly see those sessions and how you can sort of start building it into like i say an opening range breakout type strategy using that you know say pre-market information so with that let's get on with it so this one really is a quick fix we've got tesla the very popular US stock, EV stock, set to 15 minutes on the chart. No pre or post market activity on there. How do I get that? Well, head down into the right hand corner. You can see this little symbol there. Click on it, go to session and then tick extended trading hours. And then if we pull that back, we now start to see some colors on the chart. Uh, let's just you know, make them more defined. Go to settings. Um, you can see pre post market hours background. Let's darken them out so we can really see what's going on there. Now, this was you know, video produced on a Monday. So this is Friday's trading activity. You can see there in the middle. Here we have the Tesla pre-market activity you can see that kicked off and then this is uk um, times here about uh, let's call it nine o'clock uk time first one and ends just before the 2 30 start you can see a little bit of activity there um, going on a bit of a range of activity maybe not much going on with tesla there and then when the market closes you also get some activity as well now the day i'm doing this is a us bank holiday so we haven't got anything building up in this space as yet but very quickly you can see that you now got pre and post market information you got the day's activity now if you are a day trader you can use this information here to then work out or come up with strategies on this open period here you know, very quick fast scalping type strategies and I'll just quickly flick to another example to try and show you what I mean there now sticking with TradingView I'm in their scanner tool now I've got another video on that in the TradingView playlist and you can find that in there um, it goes into much more detail how you can set it up but say you're looking for stocks that have moved heavily from pre-market just before the open you want to filter out them you can go into the change tab here customize and then look quite simply you know pre-market change from open pre-market change percentage you could click on there you know tick that and it's going to give you a list obviously i've filtered out for others but like i said go through that video um and it's not well, like i said it's not bringing anything back but go through that video and then you can create a list of maybe stocks that move four or five percent you know pre-market that you might want to keep an eye on when they open up and then like i said you go back to um, a certain stock uh, i don't know it might be palantir you know, it's a favorite day trading stock at the moment for example here that's friday's action you can see a lot of noise there and you can create a set of rules you know around this pre-action on what happens you know on the open a lot of people will maybe switch that to the one minute chart um, let's pull that in and then um, then use that information like i said to create an open they might only take part of that um, opening time period let's get that tidied up a bit um, you know they might just use like the last half hour maybe and look for gaps there's no gaps here um, there you know 
there's so many options you can do around just getting this information on your screen tie it in with some of those other videos also that I've got on the trading view site you know filters you know, you know sessions um, all very useful to adding into some really powerful trading strategies so there you go another trading view top tip very useful knowing where the pre-market and after hours markets are now you know how to find them on trading view remember I also mentioned a lot of the other videos that I've got that will help you out navigate um, trading view and help you create new strategies and trading ideas and that link to that playlist the trading view playlist on my channel coming up right now